All right, Novas and Friends fans, here today we're going to tell you the truth about zero offset disc brakes versus your factory drum brakes. Are you ready for it? Here we go. All right, here we have an original 1967 spindle off of our 40,000 mile car with the original hub, original bearings, and original drum all bolted together with pretty much zero end play. It's actually a little too tight for street, but it's gonna be good for our measurements. So, drum was bolted on tight. Now, we're gonna take our combination square. We're gonna make sure that we are nice and parallel to the spindle. And we're gonna measure down to our wheel bolting surface. All right. Now, we'll get out our handy dandy caliper. And we're going to measure and see what the distance is. What do we got there? 1.82. 1.82 inches. Okay. O, E, M, drum, spindle, two, mounting, flange. 1.82 inches. Now off camera, we actually did measure our spindles, both of these, left and right, and we're within two to three hundredths of an inch which is pretty awesome. So, we are going to take our quality made Right Stuff Detailing Kit. Many people sell this, including Church Boys and all the other suppliers, Summit Racing, Jags, National Nostalgic Nova, all sell this quote unquote zero offset disc brake assembly. So now we're gonna take our last measurement that's still locked in here. We're gonna lay it across the top of our spindle and see if it touches against our wheel mounting flange. And it doesn't. You can see that it actually is going to push the wheels out very, very minimally, but typical of any disc brakes, including the factory disc brakes, they always push the wheels out slightly. They just didn't notice it back in the day because we all ran skinny tires and skinny tires up front. We didn't have no pro touring crazy cars and big wheels in the front. We we're trying to go around corners fast. We just wanted to go straight fast. So let's get a measurement here. We'll see where we're at compared to our OEM. So we'll drop her down, get it nice and parallel, snug it up. It's feeling pretty good. Get our caliper out again. Originally 1.82. We're going to see how much it has changed. Here we go. 1.71. So that's like a tenth of an inch. Plus. 0 0.11 each side equals 0 0.22 total. So there you have it, folks. Our good Right Stuff Detailing Zero Offsets are actually 0 0.11 on each side, which is a 0 0.22 track width increase, but is very nominal and very presentable for a disc brake assembly that will fit on a OEM disc brake 14 inch wheel. I think that is a very good compromise. Well, that's what we have for you today. Remember, for the money, for the teeny tiny bit of offset, well worth the investment. Thanks for tuning in. See you in the next one.